за интересное выступление, предложение. Следующее слово хотелось бы предоставить руководителю бизнес-клуба «Казахстан» Словения Дейн Штанцев. Пожалуйста. Distinguished Excellencies, dear ladies and gentlemen, citizens of Astana, dear citizens of the Republic of Kazakhstan, I am uh, happy and proud to stand here today on this uh, podium, on this remarkable anniversary of the capital of Astana, on which I wish to sincerely congratulate first to the President of the Republic of Kazakhstan, His Excellency, Mr. Nusultan Nazarbayev, and of course to all the citizens of the Republic of Kazakhstan. I came to this unique city just for the uh, first time uh, uh, only four years ago. I <clears throat> immediately decided that this would be my second home. I always enjoy when I return to Astana, where I feel extremely comfortable. And perhaps that was also the reason that from the idea once of uh, economic cooperation between Kazakhstan and Slovenia, <clears throat> we have today built the largest business club in our region, Kazakh Slovenian Business Club, KSBC. Please allow me also to say that um, KSBC last year was an official partner of uh, Expo 2017 which I'm particularly proud of. I'm also proud of the great support that the KSBC enjoys from the Republic of Kazakhstan and its institutions. And uh, for this, I thank to all those who are supporting us. Maybe also due to their support, the KSBC managed to become a regional representative of the national company Kazakhinvest in the region of Central and South Eastern Europe. We intend to connect Central and Southeastern Europe with Central Asia and to strengthen economic activity, but also ties between our people. And uh, please let me emphasize that to us, Astana already is a capital of Central Asia and uh, all economic operations within the entire Asian region we will lead from here. We see Astana as a modern economic financial center of the region and we will strive to make the best possible contribution to continuing the exceptional development of Astana as well as by attracting direct, direct investments to this beautiful country and to its capital. To find to found to find out how important Astana is for our future, maybe it's the fault of Expo 2017. It was a real pleasure to observe the whole world in the city, and the pleasure was to see how Astana changed in order to offer hospitality to the whole world. Expo 2017 may have revealed that Astana is now a modern global capital and the real place of well-being. I must admit that during this time I brought three different business delegations to Kazakhstan and uh, of course all three to Astana first and uh, all the people who accompanied me here felt extremely comfortable. They were excited, they were of course impressed by the architecture, infrastructure, but the most excited they were by people and their hospitality and kindness. I felt the same when I came to this wonderful country for the first time. And, <clears throat> sorry, and looking back, I also remember how moved I was when I read the 21st Century Manifesto, with which I immediately identified myself. In these weird times, to hear the voice of common sense, which calls for peace in the world, to trade and to attack each other, that was really extraordinary to me. And the voice of common sense, sense I'm talking about came from this extraordinary city, from Astana. 
similarly as the call for nuclear demilitarization in the world, which today in the 21st century, in the era of smart technologies that are connecting the world should no longer be discussed at all. The world are people, and people do not need weapons, especially those for mass destruction. The world today needs connectivity, knowledge, <coughs> innovations, production, development, trade, and cooperation. Technologies and their development are increasingly connecting us today. Tourism is increasingly generating global growth. People are connected in both the virtual and the real world. And it is important to know that people in history have never been so connected as they are today. That's why it's necessary to hear the appeal. The voice of common sense, the voice from Astana must be heard. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming again, uh, taking part at the conference. Уважаемые участники конференции, мы продолжаем нашу работу. Следующее слово предоставляется.